Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've got an unbagging to do today and this one has come to me from the lovely people at DIYjewels.com. Uh, yep, they've uh, sent me a few parcels in the past and said would I like some more products to show you. I said yes, of course. I loved what I got last time. Uh, I have got uh, a completion review coming up uh, in the next couple of days. So watch this space and I'll show you some of the ones I've completed. They've been awesome. Okay, so let's see what we got this time. But, oh, that one looks like a diamond painting. And, oh, that one's a diamond painting. And this one is, oh, it's a project. It's a project. It has to be a project. It's a Liz unboxing. What can I say? Okay, so there are lots of special offers on the DIYChoose.com website at the moment. I've been and had a look before I made the video. And if you spend over $39, it is free shipping, which is always a bonus. Uh, if you want to purchase anything, at the moment there's a banner coming up saying 11% off. Wow, so bad. Great, 11% off. And also, if you join up for their email list, then you get, it says an extra 10% off. I don't know whether that's on top of the 11. You would have to check that out. But they're, they're the banners that pop up when you come onto the site. So lots of savings and you can get free postage as well. So check out uh, when you're watching this video, if you are going to order uh, what applies at the current time. Because obviously, if you watch this in a couple of months time, there might be different offers. Uh, but yeah, they're really good. So go and check them out. DIYChoose.com Okay, we're going to have a look at this one first because I like my little specials. Let me see what this one is. If I can get into it. Come along, get open. There it is. I can see the opening. Just can't get into it. So we've definitely got some sparkle. Oh, we've got a little stand. We've got our basic toolkit, a pen, boat and wax. Okay. Oh, and look. Wow. Four colours. Oh my goodness me. So this is going to be a quickish project to do. So we'll have a quick look at these. We've got a pale gold there, look. A very pale icy blue. Lots of your standard, that looks like your 310 black. And then some little bit larger rounds in that gold. So they match up with those. Oh, wow. So we've got our little stand. Um, if you do see like the little bits of like scorching burning on the corners, I think these are all laser cut. So I think when the laser cut, sometimes it does just scorch the uh, wooden bits. You get that quite often on the acrylics as well, where you'll just see some like little edges that are a little bit discoloured. It doesn't affect the product whatsoever. It is just literally um, in the manufacture, no problems. But yeah, look at that nice little black stand there to stand our little thing in. And I think you can probably tell what this one is. It is, wow, look at that. We have an Egyptian kitty. Don't tell Millie. Millie Moo, our little Scotty dog, uh, my little mascot. She's not in the room today. She's uh, out playing. So yeah, don't tell her that I've got a CAT in the house. <laughs> So look at that. I do like the fact that a lot of these are coming wooden now. Um, I think they're a lot more durable because the acrylic with the best wool in the world, it is quite brittle if you do drop it. And I'm exceptionally clumsy, as you know. So I'm apt to drop things and yeah, it doesn't end well. <laughs> they do stick back together. But I do find that if I drop the wood, it doesn't break quite so easily. Maybe it's just me. But yeah, they're like um, compressed. It looks like you've got compressed maybe... MDF, which is your medium density fiberboard, or something squashed in between two pieces of thinnish ply. So it gives you, what, they're about a quarter of an inch, I think, thickness, these. And it's just a nice thickness. So they're not too heavy, but it gives it uh, plenty of stability, as it were. Oh, listen to me, stability. Uh, yep, so that is th three, three tenths of an inch. <laughs> Whatever that works out to be, I must learn my fractions. 
and that is yeah it is it's actually it's about five millimeters so it's about half a centimeter but yeah isn't that gorgeous look we've got our gold ear here and the gold eye Ooh. and then the earring here and then all these gems going around its neck so literally it's going to be all black with that little bit of gold and uh, the little blue highlights on it that's going to be stunning oh i do like that I used to have two black cats um, when I was with my first hubby. I had three cats, but unfortunately, this current hubby is allergic to pussy cats. Um, I keep thinking, actually, I'm going to borrow one of the neighbour's cats and just see whether he is still allergic. Because I just, well, I love all animals. I mean, I would have uh, an absolute menagerie if I could. But yeah, whether Millie Moo would be happy about that, I'm not sure. She's been on her own too long now, I think, to have another animal. But I do think if we did have a kitten or a cat, it may cure her chasing cats. <laughs> Does that sound crazy? <laughs> She'd have her own to play with. And uh, cats don't take any nonsense. Cats cats will like, give you a quick slap if they're not happy. So. <laughs> okay, right back to this one. So it will just go, once it's done, it will go into its little stand and stand up. Where I'm going to put it, I'm not quite sure. But I have got friends that have got pussy cats, so I can quite possibly pass it on to them as a present. So we'll see. Right, let's give this a quick measure then. So we are the actual size without uh, the bit for the stand is 20 centimeters, which is just under eight inches, uh, seven and three quarter inches ish. And at the widest part, we're about. On there is about five and a half inches ish, which is about 14 centimeters ish. So, yeah, it just uh, gives you a rough idea on the size. I don't measure exactly. I mean, if you do want exact measurements to the millimeter, let me know and I will do that. But I just think it gives you a rough idea of the size. I mean, my hands are huge, so you, you do get a little bit of a, a size thing on them. But yeah. It's gorgeous. Very, very clear drill field as well. I'm not going to have any trouble reading those. Uh, ooh. Just thinking, I wonder if I did it in a... No, maybe, maybe the sparkle wouldn't show. I was just thinking I've got a lot of black ABs and I could maybe do it all in black AB. I might try on the tail and see what it looks like with the blue. Now there, yeah... Because I just think it would make it even more sparkly and even more stunning. Just having that real... Because the Egyptians, everything was gold and luxurious and fascinating people, the Egyptians. I love watching all their programmes, finding the tombs and everything. And, you know, all the different things that they had. It was just amazing. I love all the films as well. And uh, Yeah, one of my favourite films is The Mummy. <laughs> Albeit quite, to be perfectly honest, the actor who played the mummy was lovely and I think I'd have probably run off with him. Uh, yeah, Brendan Fraser's okay, but I think the mummy was uh, pretty stunning. I think, uh, yeah, I'd have said, come on, I'll come with you. <laughs> Man, she would have probably taken one look at me and said, no, forget it. <laughs> anyway, so, yeah, we've looked at the gems, we've looked at the pussycat, so that's that one finished. Okay, we'll pop that one on one side. Uh, the price of this one at the moment on the website is £5.09. So if you're looking for a little present for somebody, either as a gift for them to do or to do it for them, maybe £5. Great uh, little present for somebody. Lovely, particularly if they love cats or Egypt or both. Right, let's have a look at this one that we can see. Okay. Right, I think you can probably tell what it is. And Smashing the Specials has now ended, but I did order this when Smashing the Specials was on. So, oh, look at those colours. Wow. Okay, standard toolkit, pen, boat and wax. Oh, so bright, vibrant colours. Oh, look at those specials. Oh, look at them in a minute. So we have these gorgeous sunflowers with a butterfly. Yay! And I do like sunflowers. Um, one of uh, my friends, my friends of, who used to be a Scotty mum, who also has um, a little sausage dog, a little dachshund. It's very sadly poorly at the moment. Uh, so all big hugs and wishes to her. 
and with her Christmas cards this year she sent everybody some sunflower seeds so yeah sunflowers mean a lot to me um, and I will be growing some sunflowers for hair as well uh, so yay I just thought this was really quite pretty Oh, we have just been joined by the lovely Amelia Moo, who's just going to get into her bed now and go to sleep. Uh, yeah, what do you think to this one, Millie? Can you tell what this is? Can you tell what this is? No, is it? Is it? Is it just not? No, it's just not got a Thomas smell, has it? No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> Oh dear, so I'll have to be careful what I say now because she's in the room and as you can see she's, although she flopped, she's now quite alert. <laughs> okay, so this has 11 different shapes and colours. I do like special drills. I do think it's sort of like a quick hit really. Um, and as I say, at the moment, the way I am, I, I just feel as I need quick hits to cheer me up as it were. So it's 24 centimetres that way, which is nine and a half ish inches. Bye. Uh, I think if we flatten it out, it's going to be 34 centimetres. It's uh, just slightly under 34 centimetres, which is just over 13 inches about 13 and a quarter inches so yeah a standard size for a special and your special drill it basically means that your background you're not doing any of your background but you are doing all of your um flowers there they've all got like lines of gems on and this gorgeous blue butterfly i think the contrast between the sunflowers in yellow and then this big blue butterfly here is that uh, going to be quite pretty sorry for about the distraction i'm just watching what somebody's doing because she's she's decided to get out of her bed now and go sniffing around everything in the room so obviously something has got a little bit of a whiff on it that she quite fancies there's no food or anything in here and there's definitely no CADs in here so hmm. oh no she's back in her bed again now she must have just caught a whiff of something <laughs> Are you comfy now? Are you comfy now? Are you sorted? Do you know what you're doing? Yeah? You can't come up here. I know you helped me unbox the other day, but it's very difficult doing canvases unboxing with you on my knee. But we'll maybe do another one another day. Okay. <laughs> oh, dear me. You don't have to be mad to live here, but it helps as the saying goes. Right. Oh. Oh wow. Oh, I've not had that colour before. Okay. So the price of this one is four pounds and two pence. So four pounds basically. And look at the different gems and colours in it. We've got that gorgeous, bright, sunny yellow, and that has got an iridescent coating on it, an A B coating. So wow, that's amazing. I just think for the price, these are so good. Uh, we've got a brown there, which I presume will be like the shading on the sunflowers. A couple of greens. Oh, three greens, look. So we're going to get a good depth of shading on the leaves there with three different colours. We've got that nice bright blue for the butterfly. And then orange. And look at that bright yellow there. They are stunning. Love that. This is going to be so bright and vibrant, this picture. And then we have these little white pearls, which are they're a little bit larger than standard colour. But look at those for the middles of the sunflower. Oh, wow. They're like a fire red with an iridescent coating. They've got all like little bubbles on the top, little circles on the top that are just going to really make it shine, stand out. And then just as some little extras, we've got these marquees again with an iridescent coating on. So are they just on the butterfly? Is that just number 11? Yeah, wow. We only need five of those. And look how many we've got. A whole packet full. Yay, I don't like my spares. So that is project number two. Okay, pop that one to one side. Love that one. And then this one. 
is in a packet so we'll see what we've got this time in this one Ooh. let me just uh, open it up see if i can remember what this one is This is, I think this could be, yeah, this is another 30 by 40. This is quite a softish canvas, okay. And it is just standard gems and drills, all in nice bright colours again. Look, I've definitely gone bright. And we've got pen, butt and watch, standard toolkit. And it is, show me ladybirds. Oh, look at those. Oh, and this is a partial. So you don't just have to have special drills in partials. You can also get standard gems in parcels. Parcels? Partials! I <laughs> can't speak. But, uh, yeah, this is a very... Uh, this is a very soft canvas, so it's going to flatten down really, really easily. But I just thought this was so cute. I love ladybirds. Um... Yes, I like insects as well. Well, some of them. Uh, <laughs> but ladybirds are just so pretty and it just really made me smile, this one. The fact that we've got, look, mummy ladybird or daddy ladybird leading them along a stem with all the water droplets hanging. Look at the size of these water droplets. And then we've got tall little babies trailing along and they've all got their umbrellas. And it just really, really made me smile. I just thought that was just so funny. So this is going to be an exceptionally quick and easy project to do because, again, it isn't full drill. It is all of the background is uh, is not diamond painted. It is just literally you're going to put your gems on your ladybirds. Wow. OK, and you still get the effect of your picture as well. So if you're just starting out or you're daunted um, about doing a full canvas or you're not quite sure if you're going to like it, get a little partial and uh, it just gets you started and plus as well something like this if you say wanting to do a picture for a present for somebody then uh, if you think oh i've forgotten to do it then you can quickly just pop and do one of these pop it in a frame and uh, you've got a lovely quick present for them but lovely clear drill field there you're not going to have any problems with those oops sorry just knocked the thing lovely clear drill field lovely clear key code there with dmc codes as well so you can put your gems away but yep yeah, this just really really made me smile oh you can just imagine a saying stop complaining i know it's raining just come on the quicker we hurry up the quicker we get home and into the dry <laughs> And that particular, oh, imagine if you've got two teenagers behind you. It's wet, I don't like this. I don't want to come out in this. <laughs> if they were really little, they wouldn't be using their umbrellas at all, would they? They'd be fighting with them as like swords or something and jumping in the puddles. So, yeah, I think we've definitely got teenagers there. <laughs> okay, let's have a quick look at these colours. So we have eight, eight nine different colours, all very pretty. So we've got a burgundy and a cherry red and some lovely bright orangey colours through to a nice sunny yellow and a pale yellow and another burgundy and a very, very bright orange and a little bit of white at the end there. Now actually looking at those uh, colours, you could change these out and actually make this into um, a crystal one and actually use your crystal gems on it so if you've got any crystal gems left over from other projects you could swap out these colors and put them as crystals so yeah i might do that might do that might not we'll just have to wait and see okay and the price of this one was two pounds and 62 pence wow i do think diamond painting is good value i mean what other craft could you do where you get a whole project, including the toolkit uh, and everything that you need to do it, apart from a pair of scissors just to open your packets. And uh, yeah, if you're like my daughter, you'd probably just use your teeth anyway to open them. Eee! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> like nails down the blackboard thinking about that. Um, then, yeah, for £2.62 and you end up with a gorgeous picture at the end of it as well. Wow. Okay. So... 
again a thank you to DIY Chews for sending these. We've had our gorgeous ladybirds. We've had our beautiful sunflowers. Look at those. They are just absolutely stunning. They look quite nice together, these actually. Um, I mean, this is quite spring, isn't it? Spring April showers. So that may go on my spring display. We'll just have to wait and see. And then because uh, Millie Moo is still in the room, we do have our uh, little uh, Egyptian um, animal. <laughs> Okay, well, as I say, huge thank you to DIY Chews. I love them. Um, I can't wait to get them done and see what they turn out like. So if you enjoyed looking at these with me, as always, a thumbs up is very much appreciated. Any comments or questions in the comments down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And if you would like to come back and see what we get up to next and join our little family, then you can do that by subscribing. And that's that little button down in this corner just here and the all notifications bell that pops up and then you'll be notified when any of my videos come up so you won't miss anything. Yay! OK, thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.